One of the most exciting moments in the digitalization of the world is what is happening right now. And it's happening right now across all industries and even throughout the space where we live in, and especially cities. Why so? 30 years ago, the most advanced industries initiated the digitalization of their work. Probably the most advanced at that time was the Boeing company when they decided to do an entire virtual airplane, creating it virtually before producing it, and creating a global communication platform to make it happen. It was 30 years ago. That revolution has served many industries in some way a parallel track to what did happen in the financial market for transaction, in our social relationship with the communication, mobility, videos, and now instant collaboration and communication. I'm not sure if it's Industry 4.0 or 5.0, and I think it's almost irrelevant because it's a continuum of digitalization that has moved from transaction to optimization of the work to connecting people together. And now it's about something new that we call the experience economy. And the experience economy is an economy that drives the value of the usage first, as opposed to the value of the product or the value of the things we produce or even the service we provide. So the center of gravity, from a social standpoint, economical standpoint, on value creation standpoint, is moving from capabilities to usage value. And this is a phenomenon that will not stop in this century. It's accelerating. The consequences are significant. Why so for the industry? Well, as much as transaction has been reduced to zero in terms of time, depending about where you are in the world, you can do a transaction that's almost instantaneous. The same thing will happen between virtual definition of a physical good on how you produce it. So that's distance reducing creates new possibilities, which are also impacting the city, because the city is the convergence of not only a social environment, but an economical performance, on, as well as education, entertainment, and many other aspects, whereby people want to be together and actually don't want to move too far to be producing things. And the uh, miniaturization of micro plants, for example, or even the miniaturization for healthcare, the multimodal transportation in cities are creating new possibilities where the system view of the city is becoming critical to create value for the citizen, for the business. That's why a platform is needed as much at, as it was needed to build planes on satellites. And no one today would decide to build those highly sophisticated products without the digital world. We believe that in the city this will happen too. It's indeed happening, like what has been done and is going on right now in Singapore. And it's calling for a new set of actions for different industries to better collaborate for autonomous car, to energy optimization, resource allocation. All those now are seen in an holistic way 
which is serving the sustainable aspect of a city. So we believe at Dassault System that a platform that can connect those large domains together, help people to understand each other, simulate the evolution of an entire city, evaluate the different options, is truly a breakthrough for providing new type of experience for citizens, citizen in their daily life, on citizen at work, on citizen having and enjoying new type of services. So I wish that the connection between the future of cities evaluated as the world is digitizing the production and the world is optimizing the use of resources to provide higher value at a lower cost with less damage to mother nature is at the very heart of not only the next industry evolution, but the next social evolution on the social evolution within cities. That the commitment that we are building at the system to create an ecosystem where this can become possible as we did it in other industries.